So we've tidied up our Wix, got our name on the header. Uh, remember that when you put things on the header or on the footer, which we'll see now, uh, those are seen regardless of whatever page we're on. You see it's still there, okay? And this is one of the reasons why uh, licensing our content, I prefer to put it on the footer just because uh, I want it to be seen on all the pages and I don't necessarily want it up at the top of the page. I want it at the bottom, but I want it somewhere where everybody can see it at all times. So it doesn't matter what page we're on. Notice I'm on the task two page. That's fine because we're going to be dragging it down to the footer anyway. So we go to creativecommons.org and we're going to share our work. And let's get started. Okay. And so Creative Commons asks you basically uh, which type of license do you want? And they have two questions here that they ask you. Three answers for the first question, two for the second one. And depending on the way you answer, you'll have a free culture license or a non-free culture license with different uh, characteristics. Me personally, uh, I prefer to allow adaptations, but I would like people to cite the original work uh, author. And notice that by allowing a commercial use, it is a free culture license. However, uh, I don't want people to be able to use uh, my ideas to make money. Uh, so that gives us a our license, okay? Non-commercial share alike. Now, help others attribute you. If you click on this, you can type in the title of the work, you can type your name in, and, and what that does is it appears in this little text here. This work by Michael Bennett is licensed under, okay? okay. Wix tutorials, okay. Oops. Wix tutorials by Michael Bennett, okay. And what we're going to do, I'm not going to fill in all the other information, is we want this embedded text. So again, we highlight it all, we copy it, we go back to the Wix site, we add. What are we going to add? Do you remember? That's right, more HTML iframe. Enter code, paste it, and apply. Okay, so notice the text is black, it's going to disappear here. And once I close this out, okay, um, and notice that when I, when I brush up onto the footer, I get a little button that says, Would you like to move it for the footer? And I would. So I click that and it jumps down to the footer. Okay. I usually like to have it over here on the left. Because the background of my page is black, I don't want, I like it that it's black, but I don't like it that the footer's black. So I click down on the footer down here, and I'm going to click on change footer design. And I'm just going to go to the customize design, and I'm going to change the color. Let's go with bright yellow. Okay, so now we can see all the text. Let's uh, save. After we save, of course, we publish. Good. Now, in case you guys want to preview and play around with your website as if you were a visitor, you can hit this button, Preview, and you can check to make sure that everything, you can switch through the, the pages all right, blogs up, no entries, but that's fine. Um, my license content, the Creative Commons license is seen on all the different pages. Uh, everything's good. So we'll click back to editor and then we would continue getting information on your about page and get your tasks up, etc. So this is how to license your web page.